Hello, I'm Lyle Weichel with uh, WestSource. We're based out of Regina, and uh, we're showing here today our Grin Tide uh, wind energy solutions, which range in capacities of 5, 10, 20, and 50 kilowatts, and they come on tower height options of 80 feet, 100 feet, and 120 feet. Uh, over here, you'll see our uh, tilt-up towers that we have. Um, basically, some key advantages of these towers are the hydraulic tilt-up feature. So if we look at the base of the tower here, you have the hydraulic ram here at the back of the base, and that's actually what stands the tower up when you're ready to commission the system. Inside the base of the tower, you'll find a hydraulic reservoir, an electric motor, and then this little remote control right here. So with this remote is how you actually control lifting and lowering the tower sections. So the entire tower is constructed and commissioned horizontally along the ground with our construction equipment. When it's ready to be commissioned, the tower gets uh, pushed up into the air. And again, that's uh, available with 80 foot, uh, on an 80 foot tower, which is included in the base price of the system, as well as upgrades available to 100 and 120 feet. And uh, these systems are installed on a helical anchor foundation. So we eliminate the need for concrete foundations, which are susceptible to seasonal construction periods, um, weather delays and that sort of thing. And they can be installed in about three hours versus uh, three days. In a typical uh, southern Saskatchewan environment, uh, southern uh, western Canadian provinces, uh, you could expect a 10 kilowatt to power a typical uh, farm operation, uh, 20 kilowatts if you have extra grain dryers, uh, grain fans, or if you have electric space heating in your buildings and uh, your your farm houses. Um, right now in Saskatchewan, there is a 35% rebate available, but in many of the provinces now in Canada, there is the ability to actually grid tie these systems, feed any excess electricity that you're using back into the grid. If you're using more at any point in time, you pull it back off the grid, so you're essentially trading power back and forth with your local utility.